Welcome to Anchor Point. I guess you're familiar with the fact that there are millions of open source projects out there. But I guess you also know that only a little, little fraction of them are open source games. How can we improve that? We think that the problem lays in project organization, and this is version control basically. Developers have Git, they have platforms like GitHub, they can easily contribute to open source projects. For artists, this system is pretty inaccessible. In a video published in May 2020 by Epic Games, the instructor Matthew Doyle is comparing version control systems for Unreal Engine. Most of the time, he is devoting to Git, which is the open source variant of it. He mentions the pros, but he also mentions a lot of cons, and these are the reasons why Git is not the preferred system for Unreal Engine. Well, here are the good news. Anchor Point is a version control system based on Git and compatible with all Git-based projects, so it covers all the benefits of Git. And it solves all the cons. Well, kind of. With your help, it will solve all the cons. Let me walk you through each point step by step and tell you where Anchor Point currently is and where it will be in the future. Let's get going. The first two issues of Git are that it's difficult to use if you're not an engineer and that it doesn't have a built-in GUI. Well, Anchor Point is a visual Git client. In the timeline, I can browse through all my commits and I can exactly see who did what. And from there, I can navigate to my project. I can use Anchor Point like a normal file browser. It shows me previews of 2D and 3D files. Finally, I can also add metadata in forms of tags and statuses to organize my project. Git by itself does not provide a file locking mechanism that protects you from conflicts. Anchor Point provides a file locking mechanism, but more in terms of a collaborative space. So you can exactly see who is working on which file in real time. And once you want to open up a file, which is currently modified by another person, you will get a warning that this operation could lead into a conflict. Git's support of binary files is pretty cumbersome. On Anchor Point, we are using the Git LFS module with some custom code and up to now we didn't experience any issues by uploading and downloading huge datasets. Git by itself does not provide any access control. With the help of MegaGrant, we could use Git submodules to bring access control to Anchor Point. Let's say I have a case where I need to onboard a character artist to my project. This person should only have access to the character folder and not to the whole project. I would be able to convert that folder to a sub-project, which under the hood is nothing else than a Git submodule. Then, this project is added to my projects list as the sub-project of the winter project. And here I can configure the project settings. I can add and remove users to my sub-project. Finally, Git is not very scalable for large repositories, large teams and large files. With the help of MegaGrant, we want to solve the issue with large repositories by implementing Git Sparse Checkout. Sparse Checkout allows me to download single files and single folders so I can connect to large repositories with over 1 million files and only download the content I need. Using this mechanism, I'm not slowing down the file tracking system. So let me tell you a bit about our team. Our core team consists of two developers and one designer. Before building Anchor Point, we were working with companies such as Maxon, where we were building, for example, Cinema 4D. We also worked at television stations and built virtual showrooms. So, our background is motion graphics, and this is also the same background of a lot of our beta testers. We currently have more than 200 of them. So they are testing Anchor Point, and they really like it so far. Let's talk about our next steps. At the end of Q3, we want to launch our MVP. It will have a robust version control feature set. There will be a commercial version for team-sized projects, and there will be also a free forever version for personal projects, so if you are only one user, or for open source projects if you connect to a public repository. With the help of MegaGrant, we could of course add the feature set mentioned before, and that would help bring version control to pipelines which are scalable and which need access controls. So, let me sum up everything. 
Anchor Point is a version control system that helps VFX artists, motion graphers and broadcasters to bring their pipeline towards real time. And hopefully it will bring more artists to open source projects. Help us to make that happen. Thank you for watching.